Hello, I'm Lawrence Wetton. I'm going to show you today how to make a clear visor, splash visor, purely from polyester film. There appears to be still a very significant need for these, certainly in the UK, NHS, and I don't know about other parts of the world. And this is a very simple way that you don't need any rigid parts. All you need is the film itself and elastic bands. So uh, here goes. And before, I, before you start, you must wash your hands as well as you possibly can and or use gloves because you've got to remember that you're, this is going to people who's, who are looking for, for, it for protection and therefore the last thing you want to do is give them the virus. And um, so what we're going to do is show you on some clear, uh, on some of printed colors. So this way um, it's much easier to see. What in reality what you do is have a um, template and lay the clear plastic film over it, but it's easier in this case so you can see see what I'm uh, see what I'm doing as I'm cutting and so on um, to do to do it with a paper film. And so we cut out the template. These these two pieces are clearance for your shoulders. Um, Wearing gloves, trying not to cut the gloves. And then what you do is punch where those two marks are. I'm just using a standard A4 size hole punch. Um, it doesn't matter if you're putting an extra hole in, it's just really hard. And um, then we fold to the bottoms of these, these two lines here. Um, Sit like and then cut a lot of the lines down to the down to the fold. Again, I'm going to show you using brown packing tape on the basis that it's easier to, to, to see what I'm doing. Try not to get it stuck on everything. Also put some on the inside. Oh. Obviously, if you're doing these in, in quantities, you can separate the tasks, but this is just doing one, one at a time. Um, right, the next task is to cut out the headbands which we use. Um, those are certain much said for using um, uh, white film for this. You can the, the, if Means the people keep them out on the on the, on the headband. Um, so the, what matters is the length of the headband, not not the width. Um, right. And you then punch two holes there, and there, like that. Right. The elastic band. Obviously, depending on the elastic bands you have, you may have to tie them end to end um, to get to get enough length. Um, and you may well want to play with it. What I suggest you do is use the first, um, the first uh, visor you make, um, have a play and use it to make up a visor so that you can use, use it when you're making the, the subsequent ones. Um, right, so you need to go through a double knot here, otherwise it comes undone. Um, right, uh, that wants to be a bag. 20 centimetres. Um, these bands are fine. Um, yes, so it's about there. Yeah. 
what we're proposing to do is source large rolls of film and then get it slit to more manageable um, lengths um, and then pe therefore people can um, make these up local to individual hospitals um, because a lot of the lot of the issues that we, there seem to be is in terms of distribution um, so there certainly seems to be much more than heavier demand in the large cities than there is in more rural areas at the moment but this may well change um, or not and finally we put some tape on the side this is to stop the rolls falling down internally on here that takes a bit short you can see in the like and so we can tighten them on a bit Uh, you really want to use a, a uh, obviously you want to use clear, clear um, sticky tape. Uh, so that's better than if you've got a tape dispenser, which I don't have. Um, so you know, the type that sits on a desk and, and rolls out and you can just click the top it. So, right, let's see how it goes. So let's just try that for size. And I'm going to fit it on. I don't know what that looks like from the outside, but it feels right from the inside.